EA Sports and the PGA Tour so proud to present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today from Wilmington Country Club, it's live final round coverage of the BMW Championship. Well, we have already seen three scintillating, sometimes spectacular rounds of golf. By the time twilight comes calling later today, we will have a champion as we check the Sunday leaderboard. Our leader here on this Sunday is our featured golfer. He's got a sizable advantage here as he looks to increase it further. All right, so that one settles in the bunker. What kind of an early test is this here at the first, Frank? Well, I was hoping for the fairway. That didn't happen. Now he's in the bunker. I'm hoping he can still hit the green. So, Frank, this, the final round of the BMW Championship, our featured golfer looking for the strong finish here, but it is a near certainty that they're going to get on a plane later for Atlanta and the Tour Championship next week. I like the first part of what you were saying, Rich. Uh, you know, a chance really to shoot a really good score today and, and sort of make next week that much easier. Normally, we just close off at the end of a 72-hole tournament, but this leads into next week. You can make next week's job a lot easier for a lot harder, just purely by a good round of day. Hindsight's 2020. Would have been great to avoid that bunker off the tee because we see evidence of what happens. A long bunker shot, well missed the mark, and in the rough. Final round here at the BMW Championship. Frank, what a season for our featured golfer. The win last week in Memphis, and now a chance to do something extraordinary, which would be to win both of these first two legs of the PGA Tour playoffs. And that, should that happen too, that's going to be a huge league going into the Tour Championship. So things change so quickly in the playoffs, but we didn't think anybody would come out of the gates this week. That's going to be on the putting surface and a birdie look straight ahead. Birdie putt coming up and we go to Iona Steven. Yeah, I don't see a whole lot of break in this overall. Distance very important. It might be one of those putts. Hit it firm, you take the break out altogether. Mm, yeah, that's a pretty good putt. Just a little bit off the mark. That finished off for par here with the second. And he's going to maintain that substantial lead. That one too close to the edge, and it's going to wind up falling into the bunker. Okay, that's a good safe play. Get it back out into the fairway. Get some distance if you can. And get set to try and make a good third on this par five. Okay, it's not stone dead, but that's not too bad. This from about 10 feet. Oh no, I think he was about ready to walk that in. That looked on target the whole way. So that safely in, it's a par here at the third. And he'll remain well in control of this tournament. Why 
Derby's been sensational all week, and here's another one that's going to set up nicely in the fairway. Pin in the back left today as he'll stare down this second to the par four. A touch long, a touch left, but still, how good can he puff? Got it there, but not quite on target. Okay, that one finished off. It's a par here at four. And that's going to keep this large lead right where it is. Beautiful tempo to that swing, and this is going to wind up squarely in the fairway. Walking the course today, let's bring in Nota Begay the third. He's got 154 yards to the hole. Pin is in the back right corner of this green. And a good iron shot, just not quite as close as what we'd all want to finish, but still. This one should work sharply to his right. It's for birdie. Of missing below the hole. That one finished off. It is a part here at five. And he'll stay at 22 under. Well, I like the look at that one. Splits the fairway. So after a big drive, 77 yards now for his second. Nothing wrong with that inside of five feet. Nicely done. Should make this about 80% of the time. It's for birdie. Okay, nicely played. That's in for birdie here at six. He's going to move to 23 under par. You don't just hit the shot sometimes, you maneuver it, and that's a really good example right there. Beautifully executed. Ah, that's gonna slide by to the left. Good work to get into that position, but couldn't finish it off. That one finished off. It'll be a par here at seven. 
and he'll remain at 23 under par. Ah, solid, a good drive in the fairway. Still 176 to go as he gets set for his second. And that ball looked good in the air. You'd like it to be a little closer, but still inside 40 feet. Just going to have to be careful with the lag putting. Close. Couldn't ask for much more on that putt. can jump up and get you sometimes. That one finished off. It's a bogey here at number eight. Unfortunately, with a big lead already, very little damage done. going to be in a good spot as that'll come to rest in the left portion of the fairway. Oh, this could be good. Just a little bit, a little bit more. I know it's 10 feet, but come on, I want it a little bit closer. Chance to close out the front side here with a birdie. Yep, that's nicely done. It's a birdie here at the ninth. And that finishes off a strong front nine. It's a 33, two under par. Uh, right after the birdie, here's a tee shot. And it's gonna wind up in the bunker. So a poor result on the tee shot. Now he'll dig in with his second to the par four. Good clean strike out of the fairway bunker, safely on the green and inside 20 feet. Now this, for birdie at 10. Well, and he's had great conversion on putts like this. Even when he's not close to the hole, he's left himself with very makeable opportunities. Okay, well done. A couple of birdies here sandwiched around the turn at nine and 10. And this is turning into an absolute runaway at the top of the leaderboard. He split the middle of the street on this one. He's going to have a good look. Second shot.
Now it's a decent sized green. It's not bad, just a little past the hole. Sizable putt from 16 feet. Look to the heavens here. That didn't need much more. So that rushed in for par here at 11. And pars will be no problem from here on out, as this will remain a full 10 shot lead. And that will be more than adequate. It's safely into the fairway. Still better than three bills away as he puts forth his second to the par five. Ready for his third shot, needs to hit this close. This one looks right on point. I'm not quite sure that strike, whether they got it all, but ball's just come up a little shy. Outside chance for a birdie. Bad. That would have been a good birdie, but not to be. That one safely in. It's a par here at 12. And he's going to stay at minus 24. is always so disappointing from that kind of a spot when you come up short. Yeah, you're looking your chops over that one. The shot you think you could hit directly at the flag. Uh, now, test for the short game. Yes, got the speed perfect there from off the green. The line was perfect too, and as a result, it's in for birdie. This one starting a little bit left. That had to be in the rough. The whole way, one more bounce back on the fairway. A really good shot on him, too, on this par five, but the work's not done yet. Uh, I'm a tough taskmaster. If he makes the part, or at least gets down in two, then I'm going to congratulate him on this hole.
Yeah, that's really well done. From that distance, you'll take it every time. Another rolled in there. Birdie's now at 13 and 14. And this is no longer a contest, folks. This one is all over but the shouting. That one, safely on the putting surface. Chance now for another birdie. Well, if that ball never really got rolling, that's gonna come up a good 10 feet short. Ah, uh, yes, Will, right there. That is in for par here at 15. And pars are fine at this point with this tournament well in hand. Bulls back in the fairway. I guess it's better to be lucky than good. So after the fortunate kick, his second to the par four. Yep, played that nicely. That'll work out just fine. Seven feet now for Birdie. Now, nah, missed it left. Mm, that's a letdown. Okay, that'll be a par here at 16. He's going to stay at 26 under par. This tournament seemingly under control as that's in the fairway here at 17. This game not just about length, it's about putting the ball in the right position and that's what he's done. Really a good opportunity to make a birdie. Let's see what he can do from 87 yards, second shot. Here we go. Nothing wrong with that approach shot. Just a little shy of where you'd like to finish up, but still, one good putt, maybe a bird. Yes, the speed spot on. It's a late birdie here at 17, and this one was over a while ago. This is just a walk in the park now. Ah, uh, 
Now you can't drive it much better than that. That's the quick pickup of the tee right down the middle. Couldn't ask for anything better. Split the fairway, and now we'll have a go at this second shot. Not super close, but uh, safely on the green. Now this for another birdie. And players of this caliber should make this on a regular basis pretty flat with just a slight movement to the left. Oh, never in doubt. Back-to-back -back birdies to close things out. Just a marvelous performance, Frank. Look, uh, I know you love EA Sports. You play all the games. You, you might win Madden football uh, by double digits, right? It is football. But in golf, double-digit victories? That's rare. That doesn't happen a whole lot. You're right. It looked like we were playing Madden the way. It was like instead of touchdown after touchdown,